uh, kahapon po nag-issue ng statement si VP Robredo, uh, quoting Defense Chief Lorenzana and AFP Chief Guerrero, saying that the military daw po would not support a revolutionary government in the country. Could we get our, your comments, sir? Tama siya. Tinanong ko ang military, sabi na, hindi kami susuporta ng revolutionary government. Sabi ko, why? Sabi nila, dahil sabi ni Vice President Robredo, mabakit? Sabi niya, mas gusto namin siya, babae, at saka hindi, hindi nagmumura, gano. Ako, o sige. Di hindi tayo mag-revolutionary government. So tama, tama no, siya. It's off, the it's off the table na po, sir. Correct siya, ha? It's off the table na po. Sino ba naman ba nang mag-revolutionary ka? Hindi mag-revolutionary ka na diritso. Bakit ka pong drama-drama? Thank you, sir. Alvin F. Chico. Pero tama siya. Ayaw ng gusto ng military siya. Ang mga dapat sundin si Rubredo. Hi, Mr. President. Si Alvin L. Chico po. Si yeah, of course. Uh, sir, aside from the meeting with the U.S. President Trump sa ASEAN, what will be the highlight of the ASEAN Summit? Anong ipopush po ninyo bilateral meetings with other countries? As bilaterals? Uh, sa Russia, I would uh, like uh, to have a small window to uh, export our products. Uh, but this, this has to be done uh, by Siguro in DTI natin and some other guys, yung mga bright guys natin, Dominguez would also be a key player there. Uh, uh, yung just a small uh, window muna where we can start maybe our exports there and find out what are really exportable and saleable. Uh, para sa akin, pure negosyo man to kasi wala naman tayong except that Russia, if... Uh, Ganang gustuhan nila, they can always support us. Uh, they have to replenish uh, the arms that were used in Marawi. And I need to have the new rifles and uh, some armaments that uh, if they are willing to share it with us. I, I can pay, but uh, it, could, uh, it could be uh, something long. Not really a grant, but it could be something like a soft loan with enough tears to uh, earn the money to pay them. You know? Sa America, well, I, I would like to say that uh, if the issue of really human rights, and I said, uh, we'll just talk it about it later, uh, we should have a summit only on human rights. But we should call all. Not zero in on me. Bakit ako lang? There are so many violations of human rights, including the United States, uh, including the continuous bombing in the Middle East, killing civilians. Pati mga bata, eskwilahan nila. And yung namatay along the way, and those who are responsible for it, uh, in the countries that, that did the bombings there, America, then you have uh, uh, recently France and Russia. So mine is just a small list. So let's have a summit of how we can protect the human rights for all the human race. And andito na lang rin tayo. Bakit pag-usapan natin yung Pilipinas? What makes the death of uh, people in the Philippines more... Uh, important than the rest of the children and the world were massacred and killed. Diba? Yeah. So we could, should call a summit and I can, uh, I will volunteer to make the Philippines a, the venue. But uh, I would call first Calamar. I have not heard you comment on the so many killings, the victims of bombs and of violence there in the Middle East. What have you been doing all the time? Why are you so fascinated with drugs? And you also should take note that there are plenty of Americans who died because of drugs. 
you need not really zero in on the police, but how about the doctors who prescribe them? The opioid uh, epidemic. They are responsible uh, for those guys who are really reckless. They should also be investigated by the human rights. You must be crazy. They are the ones who did it. You cannot get it without a prescription. Who's the culprit? See? We, you know, we live in a very incongruous world. At least for once. Calamard and the rest should be decent enough to accept it. Let us investigate all violations of human rights committed by all governments. I said just because it happened 40 years ago, it happened uh, 100 years ago. When it was wrong then, it is definitely still wrong now. JP Bencito, Madam Standard. Hi, sir. Good evening. Mm. Um, sir, following the defeat of ISIS-inspired groups in Marawi City, sir, have the government or security forces monitored any possible threats? Because um, Manila will be hosting ASEAN Summit next week. Um, can you give us um, an, uh, insights of, gov of the government? With well, uh, this is only... I, I cannot uh, tell you about the preparations, where and what. But I can tell you that the armed forces of the Philippines and the Philippine National Police are ready to meet the challenge. Okay. Sir, uh, just a follow-up question. Kapiin, come on. Uh, uh, clarify lang po natin, um, meron daw pong proposed summit on... Ah, sir, ibigay ko na po. Sige. Sir, so you summit on human rights, is it for a real or when do you like to host that summit? I, I will consult first the head of states. Here, sir? In the heads of states. APEC or ASEAN? All. Ah. World Summit on Human Rights. Kita mo, lalabas lahat yan dyan. <laughs> and all the victims of uh, human rights violation are invited to come and air their gripe or grievances. Sir, will you invite the UN to monitor the summit? Or at least UN is... Uh, I, I'm more comfortable with a, a, a panel of uh, lawyers. Kasi maintindihan nila kaagad the legal implications. And maybe experts in uh, the science of medicine and the destruction of the human body. Yan ang bumba. And, and it is fair to say, when he brought in, when she brought in rather, that black doctor and said, na use of drugs is not uh, harmful. Don't ako na wala anang respeto. Sana yung, yung, of all the drugs characterized by this, uh, Document of the United Nations. The precursors of oh, United Nations. The report is 2014. Kopyahin mo yan. Bigyan ko kayo. Cannabis. is a depression, everything. Ecstasy, overdose would uh, kill you. Cocaine, same, mixed with alcohol. Pero walang dito, ayaw kasi maniwala ng gagay. <coughs> heroin, heroin is uh, user's risk overdosing on heroin which can lead to coma and death through respiratory depression. LSD, the physical effects are small compared to the psychological and emotional effects. It's still in the, the brain. Methamphetamine. Ito. Tignan mo ang other side effects. Methamphetamine use come sometimes triggers aggressive, violent, and bizarre behavior among others. Eh, sabi ko sa inyo, lumalaban talaga to. Ayun, maniwala. Uh, 
delicious. 